got center Nick Easton. Nick, uh, things have changed a lot in a year. We see a lot more of you there with the first unit. What's it like as this new line starts to gel? Uh, it's good. Everybody's kind of learning each other's ins and outs, and uh, we're starting to come together. I'm starting to see a little bit more pulling from the center position. It requires the athleticism. Uh, is it hard to learn? I mean, what are you trying to accomplish by doing that, by kicking outside? Uh, it's just a change up, another play in the playbook, keeps the defense honest. Um, if we can get centers out and around and take advantage of the defense, we're going to do it. Now, you got Sam Bradford in for an entire training camp. What difference that made to get that continuity and gelling, not just for the skill positions, but for the offensive line? Um, it's big. He's a really smart guy. He gets his point in the right direction every time, and it's great to have him. You know, you, we spent all that time watching Peyton Manning, and he'd do the gyrations at the line of scrimmage making the calls. That's really your job. Uh, what are you looking for when you come to the line of scrimmage? What are you looking for, and how do you make those calls based on what you see? Um, obviously, it's play dependent, but any way you can take advantage of the defense, you try and do it. So, depending on how they line up or what your assignment is, you can change it up on them. You know, I was a lineman a long time ago, and I always wondered, why is it in training camp that you guys get the dark jerseys when it's hot outside, get a little hotter, they get the white jerseys? Any, any concept of that? Uh, we had the white all spring in OTA, so I guess they wanted to give us purple for camp. Okay. So yeah. the white didn't help you much in spring. It's kind of cool here. That is what it is. Zim, you know, Zim loves his defense, so. <laughs> oh, oh, we got a little favoritism going on. All right, on, on Saturday night, we got coming up, you got the, the scrimmage. What are you looking to accomplish, especially with a hometown crowd, about 9,000 people out there cheering you on? Um, you know, we got to really approach it as a chance to get better and treat it kind of as a dress rehearsal for our first preseason game. Absolutely, and obviously that first preseason game comes up, you'll get some action in that. Uh, you, you, what do you look to as you look for your progression? What do you most want to accomplish when you get to the first preseason game? Um, first preseason game is go out and really execute our plays. Um, it's our first chance to do it against somebody other than our guys in white jerseys over here. So seeing new faces and blocking different techniques is going to be important for us. Absolutely. Wish you greatest success this season. We appreciate you stopping by. Thank you.